We come from Poland, we came from Wrocław, from Katowice, from Warsaw, from Gdańsk, from Krakow, uh, from Łódź. Uh, we are Polish environmentalists, uh, we work with nature and we see our nature uh, being in trouble because of climate change. Climate change changes everything. It changes the world around us and it changes us too. Some of us were really against nuclear power. Some of us participated in the protests for the Polish nuclear power plant in Czarnowiec. But climate change changes everything and it changes us. So we wanted to check the facts and it turns out we have been lied to. The green movement and the anti-nuclear movement are telling lies. It's not true. We found out that for many years we have been scared of an important element of our decarbonization. We work with animals, we, work, we, we try to save trees, uh, we work with swamps, uh, we, want, we want to help our nature as much as we can. And what do we find out? is that Denmark and England are switching to burning biomass. And this biomass is, is trees imported from America. And this is considered zero emission energy. How can this happen? This is unbelievable. What well, turns out this regulation was in fact pushed through European Parliament by the Green Party, which now they deny and they want to turn it back. Good. It's a bit too late. So we are a bit tired of this and we realized that Poland needs to move away from coal as soon as possible. Still about 80% of Polish electricity comes from coal. We need renewables, we need wind power, we need photovoltaics, we need nuclear power and Poland will build nuclear power plant. There are many countries who will oppose it, uh, but we will do it because we need to. And we as people who fight for nature, we are not pro-nuclear because we think it's a nice technology. Of course, it is a nice technology, but it's not a gadget for us. For us, nuclear power is something that can save us from a disaster of a 100% renewable economy. Currently, Germany, 7% of Germany is covered by bioenergy crops. A lot of this is coming also from Poland. This is mostly monoculture uh, corn. This is a disaster for environment. Imagine what it's going to look like in Poland if we are going to uh, put 4 million hectares of corn for bioenergy production. This will be a disaster for the environment. So we see nuclear power as an important element to save us from this. So this is why we came and we were thinking uh, one year ago, how, what can we do to really impact the debate and impact the discussion about climate in the most meaningful way? And we realized that closing nuclear power plants is really the most forgotten and the biggest problem that we are facing right now. This reactor over there is producing as much electricity as almost all Danish wind power turbines. Can you imagine this will be shut down in three days? How dare you? This is a question to Svenja Schulze, the Minister of Environment. How dare you close this? We do not understand this and we respect the German right to the German Germans to have the energy mix that they want. This is your sovereign right. But the atmosphere is common. And burning more gas and burning more coal will pollute everybody. So this is why we came to help you because your cause is right and your cause is just. We did our homework, 
This power plant has a spectacular track record. 90% capacity factor over lifetime. This is unheard of. This is an example of an amazing German engineering. Respect. There is one thing that I want to say to finish because this is incredibly sad moment. I worked for 15 years in energy efficiency myself, building software, cutting emissions, cutting burning gas. And this gave me a lot of pride to, to do the right thing for the climate. But all of this work will be wasted here in three years, in three days, when this will be closed, because this will prolong the burning of gas and coal. So for us, it's very difficult. It's, it's something it's for us hard to understand. But I think the times are changing. The anti-nuclear movement is in decline because the climate change changes everything and it changes also the nuclear debate. They had their protest here earlier, now it's our time. And I think there will be more people in two years for the next nuclear power plants to be shut down. ISAR and others, we will be there too. We cannot allow them to go down. This is going to be a climate disaster. One thing to say about this nuclear power plant over there. I would like to thank all the operators, all the technicians, all the engineers, uh, the directors, the managers. You have done an amazing job. I don't know if anybody from working in this plant is here. Is there anyone? Uh, you have done an amazing job. <laughs> Philipsburg Nuclear Power Plant, you go down in glory. Thank you.